we have to figure out where the promised land is. You know, what, what does that mean when you're at the promised land? And I guess in the context of America, in the context of African Americans in America, it would be uh, more about equality. Uh, equality in all aspects, was social, economic, political, and all those other things that, uh, that it goes with uh, being equal in, in American society. Uh, how far we've come, uh, it depends. I know that it's someone like me would not be mayor, but for the fact that there was a civil rights movement and that there were things done that allowed someone like me to be a mayor. Throughout our society, there are prominent African Americans that are making significant impact and holding significant positions. On the other hand, we still have a tremendous amount of inequity and disparity. Uh, and it is still built into the, to our economic, social, and political infrastructure. And if you want to be successful, and if you want to achieve whatever it is, you just have to recognize you're going to have to work harder. And you're going to have to put in uh, not only more hours, but more effort, and, and you're going to have to overcome more obstacles to get to the same spot that someone else could get to without having to deal with those challenges. And I believe that Cleveland has handled a lot of adversity. Uh, we've overcome uh, tremendous challenges to become the success that we are, but we're not a great city yet because the last thing left on the table is the inequities and disparities of life that is not just part of Cleveland, it's part of America.